all questions for me. <laughs> It's around eight, I think seven or eight. I think that was the one of the competition, one of tournament in Ukraine. I was the youngest one. I was playing for my city from seven to eleven, and every single year we were traveling to city which is so far away from home, and we were playing the competition there. Unfortunately, we didn't win even once, but that was good experience for me, and I remember that time very well. Yeah, I was so funny with my friends. I loved to, to, to joke with them. But in general, I was like that. That was my face. I, def I'm, I, I definitely remember this shirt. It, it was from Barcelona with number 10 on the back with Ronaldinho, which is my favorite player. I thought I was Ronaldinho, <laughs> but in that period I was I was striker, to be honest, you know. And uh, for all Ukrainian boys, the idol was Shevchenko in that period. I don't know, for me it was Ronaldinho number one. That's, that's why I started to love football. My mom, I'll say my mom. She saw what football means for me, you know. And I'm from a small city, you know. And to, be, to become the professional football player from there, it was not possible, you know. Even for that period when I was seven or eight, if you can see on this picture, yeah, I, yeah, I didn't know about academy or something. I didn't know that. I started to know about that when I was 10 or something. Kiev is like one hour by car. And I said, wow, I want to be there. I love football, I want to be there, let me try. And I started to talk with my parents. My uncle and my, my father came there to ask about if it's possible to try. And um, they said, no, we are not allowed to do it because you live so far away and you're just 11. Just come back when you're 14. On the next day, I remember the manager, he told me, all right, if Dynamo Kiev doesn't want to see you, let's try the other, the other team. I go there and um, I used th that opportunity. No smiling, nice haircut, serious shot. <laughs> 